General Quan here. It is time for me to brief you on my current mission. Seeing as how I only have one achievement left in Sniper Elite V2 Remastered Edition, I'll be tackling that head on. Now that's cheap with this game. He's a seasoned sniper, which is to play a, com a cumulative of 40 hours of actual gameplay, which means sitting in the menu doesn't count. I have run through this game already, beating it on Cadet difficulty, and then beat it again on Sniper Elite difficulty. I also did all the multiplayer achievements, mostly farming those with a friend, since the multiplayer in this game is as dead as Hitler. Also did all four of the DLC missions and all of the co-op achievements with the same friend. Shout out to Skilly Willy for working with me on those. Uh, but after that, I still needed the 40-hour achievement. So for the fun of it, I went through the entire game again, all the missions and all four DLC missions, with pistol only. Only sniping when I absolutely had to for certain areas of the game, but trying to get through it entirely with just my pistol. And even after that, still didn't have the 40 hours achievement. I then decided it would be fun to make a video series of a uh, pistol only run of Sniper Elite V2. So that's what I'm doing here today. Uh, well, I did start doing this a few months back, but I had some technical difficulties where it stopped recording my mic after like. I did seven episodes, or seven recordings. But I've got that fixed now, and uh, rather than start, rather than pick up where I left off, I've decided to start over again. As of right now, I'm sitting at a little over 37 and a half hours of actual in-game playtime according to my career stats. So I will more than likely get the achievement in the process of filming this video series. So that's what I'm going to be doing for this. I'm going to be running through all ten of the game's missions, including the prologue, as well as the four DLC missions, using only my pistol where possible. Now there are a few points in the game where I cannot progress unless I snipe one of the enemies here and there. Uh, like for example, in the prologue, you start out with your gun aiming at the Major General in the courtyard with his Russian contact and uh, you can't get out of the scope. You can't change your weapons at all. You can't even aim anywhere across the screen until you shoot him. And then there's other points in the game, like where you have to shoot someone way off in the distance at a rooftop that is impossible to hit with your, with your pistol, uh, much less without running out of ammo first. So it's those few points where you have to snipe. So I'll be doing it for that time. And I also will be foregoing any stealth kills and no explosive kills, with the exception of tanks. Sometimes tanks, you can't shoot the gas cap with a pistol, so I have to place like dynamite next to the tank and then shoot the dynamite. Which technically that's still killing with my pistol because I'm shooting the dynamite. Now I will be doing this on the cadet difficulty. As really that's the only feasible way of beating this game pistol only. As uh, on Marksman and especially Sniper Elite difficulty you spawn with so little ammo. In fact on Sniper Elite you start out with a single magazine and your pistol and no reserve ammo. And not only that, but you die so fast from the enemies that there's just no way of getting close enough to most of them to be able to use your pistol before they gun you down. And if you do manage to get close enough and kill them, you're probably going to be out of ammo and looting bodies for ammo on those difficulties only, only really gives you like one or two bullets. So it's pretty much impossible to do it on Sniper Elite difficulty and it might be possible on Marksman. But I don't have the patience for that, so we're going to be going in on Cadet. Now on with the mission. The prologue, all ten campaign missions, and the four DLC missions, with pistol only. Mm -hmm. 